Well, folks, it is getting tense. Endrick has a £21 million relegation release clause. We are just above the relegation zone. The January transfer window is closed. We are in the final run. If we stay up, we have a genuine Brazilian wonder kid who'll be worth £100 million plus for years to come. If we get relegated, we lose him for next to nothing, barely more than we paid for him, and I'll be very sad. This is quite an important run into the end of this season. Because look at us. 17th place in the Premier League. We are four points clear of Brighton. We are one point ahead of the Kev ratio. So that's all good. That's positive stuff. Form has been very mixed, as you can see. We get the odd win here and there. As you would expect for a relegation threatened team, form is very mixed. Uh, but these next few games are crucial. Four of the worst, most pathetic teams in the Premier League. <laughs> Uh, before the tough games start against giants like Arsenal, Leicester and Newcastle. We've got to make it past Spurs, West Ham, Leeds and Crystal Palace. Cruise past the minnows of the Premier League and hopefully find ourselves mid-table before we get that run. I mean, Villa, former European champions. Chelsea, former European champions. That is a tough run of five games. This is an easy run of five ga of four games. We've uh, We've got to do our thing. And how important is that game against Brighton going to be? Penultimate game of the season. We're away to Brighton. They're currently four points behind us with a game in hand. That game has the potential to be absolutely huge. I hope Brentford and Leeds are both gone. We do play them both as well, which is handy. But fingers crossed, Brentford and Leeds are both gone. Just to clarify the Endrick scenario, the Endrick situation, that's his current value. He is an absolute superstar, but... It's not a relegation release clause. It's a minimum fee release clause to clubs in a higher division. So obviously at the moment, there are no clubs in a higher division. But if we get relegated, clubs can suddenly buy him for 21 million for a player who's worth that. I.e. he goes immediately the moment we're in a lower division. <laughs> I mean, we can offer him a new contract, potentially. Let's apologise to his agent. Um, oh dear, I've upset his agent by constantly backing out of talks. Um, yeah, we won't reopen talks now then. Oh God, that's a problem, isn't it? I'll look it up myself. I need to know now. What is a Chapman? Probably something really great would be my guess. Chapman. What occupation is a Chapman? An itinerant dealer or hawker in early modern Britain. Here we go. I don't know what an itinerant dealer is. A peddler. <laughs> wow. I've not, I've not gone far from the family trade. Also known as a, a hawker, a huckster. <laughs> oh, a solicitor. There you go. Wow. I basically... Uh, I mean, to me, this justifies my love of money. It's in my blood, clearly. <laughs> Did you know what a Chapman was? A Chapman is an itinerant dealer. Um, allow me to... Uh, a Pac-Man, a Cheap Jack, a Hawker, a Higgler, a Huckster, a Costa Munger, a Cole Porteur, or Solicitor. Basically, my surname means salesman. In England, the term was commonly used for hawking goods. Wow. Right, we're playing Tottenham. We can kind of afford to lose this one, even though it's Tottenham, because the next couple are definitely winnable. Does that mean I'll be leaving Patreon? Potentially. I need to see how this new system works first. Basically, one of the things the new website can offer is a membership service. If I look at it, like the look of it, like think I can do some something clever with it, then we'll probably finally kill the Patreon and move over to to the website. I mean, Patreon, I, I don't think I've mentioned Patreon anywhere for about three years. So it is uh, it's just the last few committed for getting to cancel it people there and now, and I really appreciate them. They're heroes. <laughs> probably, even, even when I start the new one, I'll probably just close Patreon to new people. I just let the ones who just don't, can't be bothered to cancel just carry on doing their five a month. Why not? No tax on donations. Well, obviously there is tax on donations because they still come through the books. There's tax on everything. But we're talking about pre-tax. 
I only knew your Patreon existed till I joined Discord and been watching YouTube content for about two and a half years. Yeah. The stuff we now do with channel channel membership, we used to do on Patreon. But now we've got hundreds of channel members. We, uh, I, I push that in the videos. We do the whole channel member thing every day. How does buy me a coffee work in terms of taking a cut and being taxed? Any money coming in is taxed. Um, but yeah, the, the, the coffee thing, I forgot that existed. That literally just is a PayPal donation. It's just another way of doing it under a, over a fancy skin. There's no cut, I don't think. How does Endrick feel? Very pleasant. Oh, this is not ideal. We've lost our goalkeeper. Just as we're hitting those must-win games. So we've got to play Watford, West Ham, Leeds, potentially, without our goalkeeper. He was streaming Europa League highlights or something. <laughs> Do we know what the save after the Endrick show is? 18 seconds it's taken him to score. Beautiful. He streamed football while it was live. What a silly goose. That is a finish from Mr. Endrick there. Um, I'm not completely set on what the save after the Endrick show will be. I mean, can... Oh, excuse me, ladies and gentlemen of the jury... Allow me to just present this piece of evidence one more time, taking the speed down as far as possible. Right. First touch there, up in the air, on his other foot, and then onto that foot. The ball doesn't hit the ground. He juggles the ball into the penalty area and then finishes. I mean, Endrick, you little rascal. You've got to pack this kind of stuff in. For a start, Chris. That person was right. It is Jones, not Jade Jones. Ricky Jade is his first name. Jones is his surname. Um, Poku's not a Premier League player. Um, but I love, I love Ricky Jade Jones in Football Manager, but I have to put up watching him in real life every week. This Leeds game, hugely, hugely massive, massively huge. We're going up. <coughs> <coughs> oh, I've just choked on that. <coughs> Oh, that's gone down the wrong hole. Ah! Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna try not to die. I, I'd live every day trying not to die. That's one of my one of my missions. Live as long as possible without dying. It wasn't too. I, it wasn't that there was too much for my mouth to take. It was that I was expecting a full mouthful. We stay up. We'll finish in Europe next year. As long as the board give me spensies. Ah! Oh. Ah, oh, but we're not supposed to lose against this slot. Why are we just faffing about with the ball unless we're out to score a wonder goal? Okay, I'll let you all off. <laughs> well, Dewey to Hendrick, tail as old as time. Right, we're going to encourage. We'll go attack him for the last 10 minutes if we haven't scored. Right, come on, this has got to be a goal. Hendrick. He's been training free kicks all season. Come on, Endrick. Come on! It's the Endrick show. Oh, he can do it all. There is literally nothing this man can't do. He is single-handedly dragging us to mid-table obscurity. There's no way we keep him. He is getting better and better and better. Any advice for playing in a league you've no right being promoted into? Hello. <laughs> Yes, quite a lot. Um, I suggest having a player like Endrick in your team. That certainly helped us. We're five unbeaten. Right, come on. A win here could put us in the top half of the table. Which would be bonkers. And it's Ricky Jade Jones. Come on. I'm surprised he doesn't get a work permit, though. Oh, God, Ronnie, come on. I can only assume you were trying to side him earlier than season three. In which case, he wouldn't get a work permit because he wouldn't. Oh, my word. What is the keeper doing here? We've got away with one there. Right, come on. Let's have another one. They've been doiled. Come on. I need to copy your set plays. They are on the Steam Workshop if you want them. You've been doiled again. They cannot cope with these corners today, can they? They've been double doiled.
Oh, Hendrik, you silly goose. What have you done that for? Have we done enough to be safe without him? It might be like the last time he got injured and he didn't he didn't even come in the inbox as an injury. Right, come on, we don't need Hendrik. We're great without him. Come on, Liam. Come on, Liam. For goodness sake, Liam. That is huge. 35 points on the board now. Crystal Palace just got doiled. But now the moment of truth. Have we seen the last of Hendrik this season? Probably. I and mean, he might be back. He's just getting a little bit of a rest. Can we offer him his new contract now? See, that is still a problem, the Champions League release clause. I can't ask to sack the agent unless the agent does something wrong. And let's face it, the agent is doing exactly what he should do in this circumstance, where Peterborough United, he's a 19-year-old Brazilian wonder kid who's tearing the Premier League apart. Of course he should have a release clause. I mean, we're going to have to do it and hope we get into the Champions League before he leaves. And now I have to improve my training facilities to keep him happy, do I? Oh God, and I've only got 66 days to do it. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. We've got no money. Oh, ball bags. So what we've done there, he becomes unhappy. He becomes unhappy on the 25th of May and now has a release clause. He's going to spend the whole summer unhappy with a release clause. We had him under contract for two more years with no clause. We need the board to sort us out. Oh, can I point out, you buffoon? None of you lot said that before. Where was the? Where were you all going, Kev? You know you've just agreed to to improve the training facilities. Nobody. You waited until after it had gone through before you told me what had happened. Oh, no. He's not even going to play before he gets unhappy. Because <laughs> he's injured until then. <laughs> We're never going to see Hendrik play again. <laughs> oh, no. His agent is a genius, I know. Connor. Connor. Right, well, we need to qualify for the Champions League this season then. That seems doable. Hmm. We need to sell Dewey to keep Hendrick. Oh, good. We've got a load of trash that we don't want. I trash. How are you doing? I'm nothing without my integrity. At least you know if I'm not going to save scum this. I'm not capable of save scumming ever. Because, oh my word, am I looking out the window thinking, any chance of a thunderstorm, power cut? When, when did it last save? Uh, cancel. How do, is there a way to see? I don't want to load it. I want to see when the last save was. Do you want to save the game? No, because that's going to do it, isn't it? <laughs> I just want to see when the... Can I do it? No! Oh, God, no! No! <laughs> That's what I was aiming for. By the way, we're up to 2752, trying to get a thousand years in the future. It's now started crashing. Um, so we do have a save from the 11th of March, and we've got a save from the 4th of March. I don't know when we offered him the contract, to be honest. <sighs> Hmm. 
We're not going to reload anyway. I'm not a monster. Come on, boys. This is the chance for Micah Beeriff to score against the club that rejected him. Oh, fiddlesticks. This isn't going to be the place we get them. Although, this is some nice little football. Oh, for goodness sake. 24 goals now for Martinelli. Wow. Oh, look at that from Finn Azaz. I tell you what. Ho, ho, ho. Finn Azaz, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, kick it. Oh, Henry. I nearly said kick him. Then I realized you had a booking. I would have hoped you would have noticed that as well. Did, did I just see Cody Gakpo was coming on for Arsenal there? Well, interesting. Right, come on, boys. I know there's only 10 of us. We'll be reet. Oh, niblets. First defeat in six. Interesting. It was the one game we didn't have Endrick for. I don't know if he'll be back for Leicester, actually. It's probably rushing him back a little bit. But, you know, I'm going to rush him. If the opportunity to rush him is there... He's getting rushed. He's that important. Oh, Kwame Poku as well. Who said he's not a Premier League player before? That's wonderful work from Poku. Right, come on. Get it through to Beerith. Oh, look at this football. Look at us go. Micah Beerith. Come on. We are all but safe if we win here. Put the sound on, see if there's thunder. I don't think I can bring myself to play with the sound on. I'd feel like an eight-year-old. Oh, noises, yay! Nah, you're all right. Z Zed also uses extra sounds from the ones on top. Yeah, it's all a bit unnecessary, isn't it? Micah Beerith, come on! Right, come on, lads. One more. Cherry on top would be very nice around about now. I love cherries. Oh, Ronnie, no! Football manager, you turd! All right, come on, boys. Wrap it up. Oh, why is no one on the end of that? I mean, at least the ball's at the right end of the pitch, I suppose. Just keep it up here now, lads. That'll do. Why are you there? You're playing centre-back. My Kabirif! Linesman, get your flag down, your wally. Line up on pizza. No, thank you. I don't have dessert pizza very often. Come on! Still eight games to go. I love that league table. Mauro Icardi has scored as many goals as Erling Haaland. Southampton's Mauro Icardi has scored as many goals as Erling Haaland. That's a strange sentence, isn't it? Right, we are away against Newcastle. Can we keep our good form going? Endrick is back, boys and girls. He can only play 75 minutes. Kwanzaa's back and can play 75 minutes as well. And Beer, if he's fresh off a hat trick, 20 years to the day. Are you serious? Is it actually 20 years to the day that Xbox Live became a thing? That can't be right. What would be the chances of that being true? Apart from the guy on TikTok squatting on it. The more I think about it, the more I'm convinced that guy squatting on TikTok is me. And I just registered years ago and forgot the password. So it is the 20-year anniversary of Xbox Live today. So it is the 20th anniversary of Lelujo. Well, there you go. Or just in America or... Oh, wow. All right, come on, Hendrik. Look at him. He just kicks the ball in whatever direction he feels like. Can we get happy celebration music on? You're telling me Geraldine isn't happy celebration music? Hendrick! Come on! He's back, everybody! Hendrick's back! Oh, yeah, Hendrick's got to come off. Yes, I forgot about that. We'll take him off in a minute. Oh, I see. Um, um, oh, look, we play Brentford, who are bottom. We also still play Brighton. We could end on 50 points here. We've got some relati a relatively easy run in. Right, come on, boys. Ronnie Edwards. He's only five foot ten. That's that's some that's some leap he's got on him. I think this estate is about 20 years old now. So maybe they were gonna cut the grass for the first 20 years 
And then they stopped. Right, let's have a goal before half time then. Come on, Ricky. Oh, Finner's ass against his former club as well. Perfect. <laughs> well, it was a big miss anyway. Oh, Dewey, what a player Dewey is. He needs a big contract as well. It's not fair just to give Hendrick all the money when Dewey's the real star man. And I tell you what, Micah Beareth is turning into a Premier League striker. I think there is a video specifically called I Signed Hendrick for Peterborough. And then the next video is I Signed Bellingham for Peterborough. So it's back-to-back -back videos from about a week ago on Alujo 2, if you want to go and see the full stories of how it happened. Maybe, maybe, mods, maybe you could uh, link to that. Because people ask that question a lot. That might be a handy thing to link to. A little dusty back there. Nah, it's a pattern on the monitor. You just got doiled! Right, come on, let's have another one. We want five. Micah Beerif's in again. Micah Beerif! Come on! How many days until Grumpy Hendrick? Not many now. 31 days. Bill's time is running out for the manager to improve the club's training facilities. I asked. There is nothing more I can do. I asked. They said no. There is no more I can do, Hendrick. Silver lining is the unhappy clubs. If he's unhappy, clubs may try to lowball and not pay the release clause. Yeah, but if he's unhappy, he'll force his way out anyway, won't he? Come on, boys. Oh, we're wearing the, the mint chuck chip kit today. We don't wear this very often. Micah Beerif! This boy is in form! Thoughts on the Ronaldo situation? I don't really understand how there is a Ronaldo situation. We didn't learn anything new. Henry Lawrence, the former Chelsea youth player, letting them know what they could have won. What? What? Okay, did we have a... I guess we had a... I don't understand. Did we have a future fee agreed as part of his loan? Have we just, have we just avoided relegation? I think that was 3.6 million if we avoid relegation. I think we've just avoided relegation because he's only played 19 games, so it's not an appearance thing. Have we mathematically avoided relegation? 45 minus... Someone did... We've avoided relegation! I mean, we didn't get any message. We only know... <laughs> We only know because he's signing. Well, I never. Oh, there we go. Come on. Oh, God, this lag is getting worse, boys and girls. And Ricky J. Jones has scored a goal. If they're already in your team and they're playing well, don't worry about needing to replace them. Just because a certain number doesn't look right. There's so much of what makes a good player in FM that's on hidden attributes that you don't even see. Oh, Mishu. Oh, I hate this Windows update nonsense. It's absolutely wrecked the end of this stream with this stupid lag. The net, uh, Outside of um, the streamer showdown or like the very first stream of a new series. So it's 1.1K on mine. Wow. This, this really does indicate that what we're doing with the Lujo 2 is in full flow. That's bonkers, isn't it? What's less satisfying is that it's now 2-2 against Fulham. In talking of schedules in the World Cup, no idea what stream schedule is going to look like next week. We are going to figure it out and play it by ear with the World Cup. Finn as is in. We're going into Europe, boys and girls. You're not going to be able to stop us. I watch more because I'm caught up on the Lujo 2. See, it works. Bobby Pell, thank you for the prime. All right, come on. Here we go. Ronnie Edwards. And look at all those nuts as well. We're on a hype train. It's all kicking off. Hello? What you got for me? A little gift? A little gift for, for Kevy. Kevy gift. Should we see what this is? I bet it's something boring. What is it? It's 
my testicle powder! Oh, lovely! Testicle powder, everyone! Lovely, I mean, I'm glad that's arrived. Testicle powder and hair product. It's my Amazon monthly subscription. Beautiful. Mathematically, we can't get to the Champions League. but We could get into the Europa League still. We have three matches to play, and then we find out if we can get the training facilities to save Endrick, and then we've got summer transfers. It's going to be shenanigans ahoy tomorrow night. We'll be live about 6.30, 7 o'clock-ish, um, and of course, highlights of both this and that will end up on Illusio 2 as well, so make sure you are subscribed to that 